Now what we have here is a Cubic Communications receiver uh, R350. Uh, it's a single receiver in the box. And you see the modules, everything's modular and shielded, so it's supposed to be really you know, mil spec, so that's what you expect. Um, this one's missing the I, uh, ISB uh, module, should be there, but it's not. So um, I've had to replace second reference, or reference to second LO and a, with one from a 20 or from a 3030, 30, 30, 30, and a detector from a 2411, which is a military, another, another cubic machine. And it seems to work okay, but my problem with this is the AGC and the level and the gain seem to be kind of wonky, and I'm trying to get some, some uh, guidance on that. As you can see, the, the, the level meter pegs whenever you have any kind of station or anything going on. You can be on or off the station and it'll still do the same thing. There's also a lot of radio hiss in the back. The noise floor is probably double or triple what it, what it should be. So I won't pull at your ears with that. Um, but generally, we go through when you talk about the gain. Uh, 94 is about, it's, it's on or off at about that level. That's the, so. The gain is how much signal gets into the radio. Negative 94, if I go 96, boom, zero. Go up to that, it pegs. And it goes all the way down to zero, all the way to 127. It's just really, really suspect, so. Um, If you get it to a certain point just below it, it actually acts like a squelch. So I'm just going to recall or cancel that. And but if you go to the to, to meters, audio meter. Now this is interesting because when when I did the game, obviously that makes it a manual game. Uh, with AGC is automatic game. Suddenly the audio cleared up, but the, the various settings do not matter. Medium, small, medium, slow, high, or fast. Only thing that makes a difference is if it goes off. You see, it's all it's all crazy that way. Go to AGC, and it kicks right in. So there we go. Now if I go to the meter, different meters, the audio meter works fine. That, that, there's nothing wrong with that. And the frequency meter tells you where you are there too. So it's only on the, on the, on the gain that we have that problem. Now I did have to replace, this data when I first came to me did not work. I had to replace the detector with one, like I said earlier. And that seemed to clear it up, but there are some circuitry differences there, like an after filter and things like that, which may clean up the sound if it was the correct one, but I don't know. Um, if I go to level and I check that out. That seemed to be okay too. Um, so, um, I don't know. It works in, I've tried it in different modes and it works in all modes. Um, but once again, that gain is just kind of sticky. You have that point where it goes on or off and it acts like a squelch. And, um, the noise floor is the biggest complaint I have with this. So, uh, anybody have any advice for me out there? I'd appreciate any, any kind of feedback. Thanks.